Update! And it's been another week. I want to talk to you about the music that was in episode 8. Some of it, at least. When Donald and Jonas are kind of uh, just hanging out in places, passing the time during the day, there were three songs that I used. Uh, one was called Winter. It's by Exit Project. They used to be called Exit Project. I'm not sure if they're still called Exit Project. My sister and her husband's band. This one. Lovely. MHRV.com. You can check that out. Links in the dupes. And then at that same bar, later on in the day, Take Flight by LeVar Allen was playing. Link in the dupes uh, to his YouTube channel, uh, which you should check out because he's awesome. And then here's your freebie, all right? When they were in the comic store, I was looking for a song that was kind of like, I wanted it to be a little goofier playing in the comic shop. And I ended up with this song called You Know, which I wrote Adjectives. quite a few years ago, now. six or seven years ago, and recorded at my parents' house uh, on, in GarageBand. Yeah, Adverse. song called You Know, just a fun song about whatever. And I put it on my SoundCloud. There's a link to the dubs in that, and 100 people can download it for free. Uh, more would be able to if I paid for my SoundCloud account, but I don't want to do that. So 100 people can get it for free if they want it. Help yourselves. Just a goofy song for free for clicking on an update on a Sunday. I hope everyone had a happy 4th of July in America. I hope everyone had a happy... Fourth of July is a calendar day, not a holiday, outside of America. Still, when we publish an episode of the Platoon of Power Squadron, when we put it up, it's not over. <laughs> like, that's there's still more to be done because of the donation gifts. We have to get the DVDs together to send out and all that stuff. Um, I, I closed captioned all of the episodes on YouTube. Uh, I'll talk a little bit more about that in another update. And also for the donation gifts this time, certain people donated to get a PDF of the script with all my script notes in it. Like all the shot notes just start cramming into the sides and everything. I basically spent the night um, watching Southland Tales for some reason. It's a movie that intrigues me even though it's completely incomprehensible. The only Richard Kelly movie I truly love is Donnie Darko, and the others I just kind of keep getting drawn back to for reasons I can't understand. But So I was watching Southland Tales and then scanning in the pages of the script one at a time, and they're uh, like all told, including a, a personalized note from me to the donors and the flyer from the end of the episode, the orange flyer from the end of the episode, which we actually made up. It's a nice orange flyer Eliza made in uh, with some clip art there and everything to get all of the hipster peasants to the party, the free party. Once the episode is up and we get all the donation gifts taken care of, then I can move on to episode nine. So it's a process, but I have also taken a few days to actually just relax. And I've been reading Mr. Mercedes, the new Stephen King book. I just read a book called The Creature of Moonlight by Rebecca Hahn, which is a good fantasy book I recommend for those who like fantasy, YA fantasy. Good to get a chance to read. I'm going to watch Looper with the director's commentary to celebrate Ryan Johnson being named as the Star Wars director for episode 8. 8 and 9? I'm not sure. Anyway, love Looper, love Brick, good movies. And so I'm just kind of like taking a few days, li hanging out with Lies. I've hung out with Lies for a little bit. It's awesome actually hanging out with the person you're married to instead of just sitting in the office working on stuff. I highly recommend it. I have a question for you guys that I've been thinking about a lot, and I keep wavering back and forth on it, and I just want you guys to make the final decision. And I will abide by your decision, so let me know in the comments. Okay, when people click on episode one, it freeze frames for a second and directs them. If you're only going to take one chance on the Platoon of Power Squadron, please go watch episode five, part one. That's what it currently says. It used to say three, part one, but five, part one actually looks pretty decent. 3 Part 1 still has the old mini DV quality to it. But I think 3 Part 1 is where the story really starts. Prior to that, the Platoon of Power Squadron episodes are, are establishing what they were before the events of the series take place and they actually start trying to, you know, hero it up a little bit, at least Donald does. Should that link take you to 3 Part 1 or 5 Part 1? What do you guys think? Whatever gets the most votes, I'm going to go with and leave it there. Because I've been thinking about it too much. Let me know in the comments. I would love to hear your opinions. Thank you so much. I hope you guys have a good week, and I will see you next week. Bye.